Hi everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how to print both even and odd numbers by using while loop in python. So let's get started. So first we'll be getting the number n from the user which is going to be the number till which we are going to print both odd or even numbers. So let n be the number equal to int of input enter a number and make sure that you are having here int because if you don't give here int this is going to be treated as a type string so have that word there and let me just come to the next line and i will just have a while loop while and for printing the odd numbers or even numbers first we need a temporary variable okay so first let me show you how to print the even numbers and next with the odd numbers so in case of even numbers we need to have this temporary variable i as 2 because 2 is the smallest even number because 1 is an odd number and 0 is a neutral number. So the first even number that we are going to print is going to be 2. So you need to assign that to i and the condition in our while loop is going to be i less than or equal to n which is our input over here. So this while loop will run continuously till our i value is less than or equal to n. And inside this while loop I will just have a print statement and I will be printing i. So now we are good. The final thing that we need to do is we need to increment the value of i because we are just having an initial value. We are having a condition and we are printing it. But we need to increment the value of i so that it prints the next even number. So for printing the next even number continuously, we will be having here i equal to i plus 2. That's it. This is the code basically. So now let me explain you how this is going to work. So for example, let's have an input number uh, n as 10. Okay. Let 10 be the input number and it will check here the condition initially i value is 2 so 2 less than or equal to 10 condition is true it goes here 2 gets printed in the next line i equal to i plus 2 so i value is 2 before this and it goes here i equal to 2 plus 2 which is 4 so it again goes here this time i value is 4 4 less than 10 condition is true 4 gets printed again i equal to 4 plus 2 6 goes here 6 less than 10 6 gets printed and 6 plus a, uh, 2 is 8 and again the same thing 8 here it gets printed and it becomes 8 plus 2 which is 10 and again goes here 10 less than or equal to n so 10 is equal to 10 so 10 will also be accepted inside this so 10 and after this i equal to 10 plus 2 which is 12 so now i value becomes 12 and this condition fails because 12 less than or equal to n is false and basically while loop terminates and we'll be getting this in the output so this is how it works so let me just remove these things and if i save it and if i run it now enter a number let me go with 10 so here you can see i'm getting the even numbers 2 4 6 8 and 10 so this is working fine and for printing the odd numbers it's just a yeah, small change okay rather than having it as 2 over here just change it to 1 that's it if i save it and if i run this exact same code i will go with 10 again i'm getting all the odd numbers 1 3 5 7 9 okay now let me explain you how this is going to work so consider the same thing um, let me go with n equal to 6 this time and uh, yeah initially i value is 1 it goes here 1 gets printed i equal to 1 plus 2 which is going to be 3 i is 3 3 less than 6 true 3 pr printed 3 plus 2 5 5 over here 5 less than 6 true 5 gets printed i equal to 5 plus 7 uh, 2 which is 7 goes here 7 condition is false because 7 is less than or equal to 6 is false so that's it we will be having 135 in the output so the logic that works here is that if we add a even number with 2 that number is still going to remain as an even number for example 2 plus 2 is 4 even number 4 plus 2 is 6 even number and if we add 2 to a even number that will give us a next even number exact same thing applies for odd number also if we add 2 to your odd number that number is still remains as odd and it also gives us the next odd number for example 3 plus 2 gives us 5 which is an odd number and it is also a next odd number to 3 
5 plus 2 gives us 7, which is exactly the same case. So that's the reason only our initial value is enough to change, make those changes, okay? So this makes a lot of difference. So for printing both the things, what you can do is both even and odd numbers at the same time, you can just have one thing to print odd numbers and you can basically just copy the exact same thing and you can just come here and paste it here. And let me just cut this. I'll just have here j equal to 2 and I'll just change here j rather than having high. I'll just change here j and don't change the n okay n should be common and let me just have a print over here print even copy this paste it okay it's going to be odd All right let me just now save this so odd should come here even is here okay I'll just cut this this odd numbers because i value is 1 and we are having here the while loop with i so, and this is going to be even yeah saving it now if i run this 10 so here you can see i'm getting the odd numbers 1 3 5 7 9 these are under 10 and i'm getting 2 4 6 8 10 okay so basically we're getting both the even and odd numbers till our number n okay so i hope you would have found this video useful do check the playlist of my channel I've done a lot of tutorial in Python as well as C, C++, Java, MySQL and MongoDB queries. Check them out. Subscribe me. Thanks for watching.